This episode of IJDM, we are unboxing and testing out the Ryobi 1800 PSI 1.2 gallon per minute electric pressure washer. Up next on IJDM. Another visitor. Stay a while. Stay forever. Okay, what we have here is the Ryobi 1800 PSI pressure washer. We'll just stick with that. It's got a turbo nozzle, lightweight design. My old pressure washer died, needed a new one. Hey, why not do a Ryobi product thing? Ryobi, if you've seen these videos, yeah, I would love to test out any of your new products and do a review on them uh, and see how they work. But I've, I gotta say, I've had a pretty good track record with Ry Ryobi products and as far as them lasting, some things yes, some things no. But uh, hopefully this will be one of those better products that I've tested over the years. So with all unboxing videos I do, it takes up more time. So we're gonna save some time and just use the handy dandy unboxing app now. Wait, that didn't work. What is it? Now. Huh. Okay. Am I doing some? <laughs> yeah, I didn't look at my phone before I started this video. It's one of those things once again. Guess what, people? Yeah, there's an update pending on my phone. So let me go ahead and update that and we'll see. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's, okay. It just and updated pretty quick. Okay. Now that we got the update, the box unboxing app updated, let's go ahead and see if this will work now. Okay, all right, <laughs> that worked. We have the pressure washer here on off switch. We have the nice long gigantic wand with the thin hose, which they say is better. Connectors right there. We have a handy dandle, heavy dandle. We have a little holder here for, unfortunately it doesn't fit on my shelf that way. So I, <laughs> I guess for carrying it around, it would be handy to have that. But when I put it on my shelf, I obviously got to just kind of do it that way, I guess, because there's no way it would fit. Backside just where the power cable comes out. Nothing really on the side. No, this is not 18 volt. This is actually powered. Most of the 18 volt ones I looked at, it just didn't have enough pressure for what I needed. And it was almost probably like a quarter uh, of pressure of what I need to actually get things done. In 1800, I'm really pushing it with all the cement pads and, and patio bricks and pavers that I clean and house and everything. So really, this is kind of a compromise, but we'll see how it works uh, in the video. It came with a couple extra nozzles that only fit two of them in there, but uh, that's okay because, you know, I'm usually using one and uh, these are for more narrow band. And we'll try out the standard yellow, which is what the one I use the most. I forget what the angle of that is, but uh, just creates a nice wide disbursement. And then it's got this other one, I guess, that does like a, this other thing that does like a swirly kind of deal. Supposedly that's really effective from, from what I read and different things. Oh, on the back here, didn't see it before, but the cordless covering it is little filter thing where you attach your water, your hose. So this looks like it's gonna be a little better than my old one that was just kind of this tower thing, but this thing looks a little more compact. Um, so next thing we need to do is go ahead and test this thing out and see how it does. I gotta say, with the whole thing, I know I added music and whatever, and you didn't hear me talking much, just because of the noise this puts out, it would've been kinda hard to discern what I'm saying. But as far as the attachments go, I found that this worked worked perfectly for, for my needs. Maybe some of you would say, no, I prefer the old school uh, you know, attachment, but uh, yeah, I really like the, the whole thing, the way it does this rotating thing, and it feels like you get more per swipe or per each row that you go across. I do apologize for not having something more 
like filthy looking that I could have pressure washed, but I really did look around the house and best I could do was just show you my, you know, patio and, and uh, you could just kind of see the pressure and see the thing working. Overall, give this thing two thumbs up. It says what it does, does what it says, and it works. That will do it for this IJDM. I appreciate you watching. Be sure to subscribe, check out the Patreon page, blah, blah, blah. We'll see you next time. Woo!